one go and so as promised today is that bath and body works video that i was talking about this purchase was made in november 2022 at the time everything was for um all body care items was four dollars and if you spend over 50 you would have gotten free shipping and i was like yo we're in a january no i don't think they want to see it and then my son you know you know the new generation and because young Eddie was like mom content so you know you don't know who want to see what you have to say about it because nine out of ten times as always and tell you I've been purchasing the stuff and sometimes through my over when we work like I work outside the home and inside the home and then especially when you get in a mom mode you just you know so I don't want to neglect the channel I want to keep more words and push stuff forward and show you what it is that I've got so before I share with you what I purchased um, back in November, when I did um, the video before this one that was the Spring 2023 Fragrant Mist for Bath and Body Works and I was saying, oh my god, I forgot to bring down the body wash. I was talking this um, body wash, the Sun in Bloom's body wash. And funny enough, even in this, the body wash, the scent is stronger. I did not smell it um, for the Indigo Dreams. I did not smell the body wash for it in stores. Because typically, I normally run to the fragrant mist more than the, um, the body washes. For me, I prefer the moisturizing body wash over the... These are still good, but just preference. Shower gel are good. But preference white, I just love the moisturizing body wash hence why it never clicking on me it like yo empo i never smell the indigo but to get even a more stronger scent turn them together yes so i'm still stand firm like if you're going to get from the line just get the sun blooms and sweet and the indigo dream i don't know probably go back over there more you know smell the body wash in which so for the most i rest of it you know the bag anyway so let's get into the November purchase. Now this is the body scrub and this is a glotion. What I mean by glotion is me a glow. This is the winter candy apple. If I don't give notes to everything, don't mind that. I don't really want the video to be long. I'm honest enough for the like long video. Worse every now and then the <laughs> the language barrier, the English are chipping. And then we just want to do the video in a like straight part one. Say, here we're going to go to the scuba bottom body work and pick up the winter candy apple because the glow one smell good. And I'm like, uh uh, most of them not going to understand. But back to this, love, love, love their body scrub. Again, this one just glow. And if you don't know the scent for winter candy apple, it is red apples, winter rose petals, candied orange maple leaf and fresh cinnamon and just like the name it is really a candy apple with that little you know cinnamon vibes and this is what i'm talking about when i said i love the moisturizing body wash over the shower gel i absolutely love it my goal is to own it all in fact when i did the um the shopping this year for the the new collection I'm actually said they among the clouds into this as well but that is going for $17.95 and these normally, like these ones are what, 14 right? These are $13.50 and the aromatherapy is like $15 and chain. So I said that for, for, for $17, I said, I'm going to jump all the way from $13, not even the $15 then, as a new, if you want to say $15 as a new, but $17, now I'm love, now I'm love, I'm never going to spend that. I don't have free money. Which are my money, you know? But no, mm -mm. whatever I go to eat. And then we have the Midnight Amber Glow, which in fact, I think for this, it's going to be discontinued, which I honestly think they're going to, they're discontinued where the name is concerned. I think they're going to bring it back with a different name because the name is not fitting for it. That's the only problem. Me personally, I have with this the name, which is the Midnight Glow Amber. It's the name like car Midnight Caramel Latte, Midnight Latte Glow. It has nothing to do with amber, even though it has smooth amber, caramel latte, and vanilla Burma. This with the coffee whiskey, I'm telling some by three of that. This and this together, coffee and an alcohol high, like whiskey and the bourbon. 
and the coffee and the caramel and the latte, everything. This is coffee and this is drunken coffee. When you combine the two, drunken coffee. Love it. Love, love, love it. And then last where the body wash is concerned, always want to get my hand on this. Two days I forgot the store, but online sometime this day is selling out. My goal, na pay full price for bath and body work. So give me a good coupon and a good seal and girl gets it. So this is the from the aromatherapy, the eucalyptus and the spearmint. And for this, it is leucalyptus oil, which clears the mind, and spearmint oil, which soothes or uplift you. And all in all, this is really just a nice pununus. So it's a pununus, it's good like that, yeah? Yeah. So I love it. I wouldn't mind getting more backup set when it comes on sale. And then I, this is so luxurious, which is the pure one now. Make sure you grab it into the diamond Shimmer Mist, I absolutely, this is just luxury in a bottle. Like, if you're one of them who wants out, you're not into perfume, but you still want your body, <clears throat> your body splash or your fragrance mix to be up there on that perfume level, then you can get pure wonder. You don't have to get it into the shimmer. They have it into just the fragrance mist. They have it into the perfume too, but get it into the fragrance mist. Can't go wrong. Smell so, so like, real I in perfume at the time back up which is the white t-shirt this I love to use is for layering scent this don't throw me off with nothing I've layered it with so many stuff and it doesn't throw off you know maybe because it's that clean linen so you know like when you wash clothes and if you don't normally use your um laundry sheet like you don't use sheet in the dryer or you forget to or you softener you know, it just really amplify whatever scent you layer with it. It's just like a layering base. So this nothing. This is the fourth one. My have. So I'm glad my have it because I really love layering it with most of the scent. I've always loved winter berry wonder. And for last year, I don't know if anybody else knows. It's not so last year. Bath and body work. They were on a berry season. If it's not strawberry, it's raspberry or it's berry. Wildberry, blackberry, the whole of last year, check it. If you purchase most like me, check if every known don't have something to do with uh berry. But winterberry and next nice one for me. Quite close to not the same. But back home in Jamaica, we drink something named Sarrel over Christmas time, and it just reminds me of Sarrel. Not like it, but just reminds me of Sarrel. Alright, so next nice one. Again, if you see me, I read out the note for most of them. No feel. But then we have the winter cherry blossom, which is frosted cherry blossom, ruby berries, and silk amber. Now, for this, most people were saying, for them, it reminds them close to the Japanese cherry blossom. For me, it don't make sure I carry them down. So this is my Japanese cherry blossom. And I also have the cherry, the cherry blossom. All right. Now for this, the only thing with this, love it. Wish it have a red cover. I'm going to put the red on it and look. Look, I'm going to put the red cover on it before we get to it. <laughs> look. Ah, uh, no nice. I'm going to know, but <laughs> it's just me. I'm packaging. <laughs> but I'm sick of it. But for the Japanese cherry blossom, if it, it has Japanese cherry blossom, Asian pear, fresh mussels, petal, white jasmine, and blushing sandalwood. And then for the cherry blossom, cherry blossom is dewy watermelon, great green lush accord. What is that? Wisteria petal, red plum, cherry blossom, sheer freesia, soft moss, sal, um, sandalwood, and helothrop. What that? H E L I O T R O P Helotherapy. I mean, I know a big word. Now I bust my mouth. For me, it smells closer to the cherry blossom minus the sandalwood and the watermelon. For me, remember, a sense of sense different, but for me, it is closer to the cherry blossom than it is to the Japanese cherry blossom. Nonetheless, love all three. Look, this. We have two, one finish, and I'm have this. I'm going to notice when I see come back some baby, I'm pinch, pinch this. Pinch, pinch it. Yeah, pinch it up. 
Okay. And then next we have. I turn the page. I hope you didn't look like it for the long so. Okay, I'm a little bit long. So next is the wrapped in vanilla. To be honest with you, when I first smell this, I never like it. I don't know why. First, it's something about it that threw me off. And I was like, ah, I never expect it to smell like this. And then I don't play around with it. Then I say, no, I'm going to make it sit. Then when it sit, I eventually start liking it. But you know what made me like it more? Let me read the notes and I'll tell you what. This is soft vanilla, velvet sugar, and chantilly creme. And I was like, what the hell is uh, chantilly? And then I Google it and it's really just French to sell whipped cream. French version of whipped cream. I'm like, okay. Then this is what I did. Because at the time, I didn't make a purchase of the strawberry snowflakes. Now this and this together. Hear me out. My, you might not for you, but for me, when I put this together, I'm getting tra strawberry cheesecake. I'm gonna know I love it. When it dries down together, I mean, both of them together, it gives me strawberry cheesecake. But I don't know, but I like them together. And that, this is how I end up start like this. And even I'm gonna take this away and then let this stand it. And I'm like, ah, here is the beauty. But at first, I never like it. I'm not gonna like it soon. No, no none at all. This the one that I love. The blush cardigan. Oh my god. Sorry, I never get a backup of it. Sorry, I did not get a backup. This is oh so good. This is sweet raspberry, sugar dip violet, and warm amber. And this is like a strawberry shark cake. It brings me back to high school in Jamaica. You used to go to a class called Home Economics. Where you go cook you the sewing. You just to learn for the um domestic stuff, right? <clears throat> Sorry. And we remember putting the um, the raspberry into the pot and pour sugar. I uh, mix it and I warm it up. And it just takes me right back to that when the strawberry in you know, the sugar pan, the stove. And you know, yeah, whip it up for, for start laying it before you're laying it on the um the pound cake. So just, just give me the strawberry shark cake vibes. Like I absolutely love it. Just warm. Sweet, but not too sweet. It just, just think of what we just said before about just the strawberry, you know, the sugar on the stove, and you just uh, whip it and I blend goodness together. I absolutely love it. You realize it? I said raspberry again. Last year, boss, I'm bad word in the pan. So they also re released the cozy evening. I did not take that one because this is from 2021 and this is the um. Wait, name. This was the home body collection. So this, which I have to say, and I don't remember if I, I think I did a video. And when I was doing it, I tell you guys that cozy evening is going to be the one that was going to be sold out because it really just smell nice and pulling rose and just really give it that evening vibes. The misty morning. Me so when you wake up early in the morning, you know when you wake up early and open the door, you get that little morning air like that between the hours of like four and six that look morning breeze there and then afternoon sunshine it, the name just fitted so there was no need for me to get it back because again i had the collection all right and then so make it this far big up on the sub make sure i'm a best and i make the video too long probably somebody don't mind it <laughs> they won't boring i just want to see what emperor put up she put up this <laughs> then we have the I don't remember what this collection is called, but it's three of them. Because after the way, like, Australia, I don't remember the name. But this is the Golden Eclipse. It is Glowing Berry, Shimmering Blossom, and Sun Warm Woods. This is just a warm floral berry. Just so I talk about with berries. Like, it just, it even won't come off. You know how cashmere, is cashmere on like a powdery, warmish, we just use the word warm floral. Yeah, that little, you know, coziness to it. It's like a cozy berry. That's all the golden eclipse. For me, then we have the prismatic star. For prismatic stars, it is raspberry stardust, mystic plum, and cosmic, <laughs> cosmic cashmere. And for this, I was saying it is a powdery raspberry like that's what it gives me like powder so some and then 
because it have to do with outer i think these should have been more like of a airy scent instead of such a fruity florally it should have been something more eerie because throughout the galaxy you know outer sky really looks like something like that instead of where it really come with and then we have sapphire moon which is sparkling pear sheer freesia and moonlight moss and this is just giving me like a light moss with a hint of pear nothing nothing special they really do and the pear is a fresh pear like really really fresh it's not it didn't reach the right stage yet it just green fresh it just know you know you just cut it in you know, so it is a pear and a little light must here and then last but not least the one everybody that over the moon about which is life of the party for life of the party it is pink citrus bubbly purse Prosecco, jasmine, and shimmering vanilla, and it is ex it even smells just like how the bottle look exactly like that. Just think of you have a little, sh you know, call it wine glass, and then you pour a citrusy wine into it, and then you put the whether it's the orange or the lemon. Just think of a citrus, it just catch on the edge, the white now bubble up, and then it does squirt like a little vanilla syrup into it, like. And it's just bubbly. Like, we can smell all of that. Every single note, we just read on it, you smell all of it. So it's just like a glass of citrusy, finally, champagne. So and that completes what I, what I picked up for the November $4 body care sale with them have a go. Uh, the next video I'm going to put up is... Oh, God. I'm going to have again. I'm going to want to say, come, I'm going to say it and... <laughs> It probably not come, but a next video coming up right behind him. So yeah, that's a that for most of them. You now look at your hand on it. I think the only thing here you probably can find is the pure wonder. You know, Japanese cherry blossom. I got always the pan the sides and uh, you can not find this. The rest of them like I'm tired, yeah. Anyway, if we make it this far, pick up on a nice clean self, and I'll catch you guys into the next. I'm going to think about what other video I need for sure. Alright? Yeah, bye bye.